Welcome to PC Gaming Tech Summary. I'm your host, Gamer, and today we look at how long does it take to render or to make a 4K YouTube video? Well, we've got the new 12700K with 12 cores and 20 threads, and it does an amazing job. So, I used to use a 7700, an Intel i7-7700, four cores and eight threads. And if I rendered a 10 minute video, it would take around 14 minutes or so, 14 minutes or longer. So, sit right back, have a cup of coffee, and we'll get into it. Equipment uses a 12700K with the two efficient cores overclocked at four gigahertz. EVGA 306012 gigabyte is our GPU. Um, we've got DaVinci Resolve on a Gen 4 Fire CUDA 520 NVMe, and all the other files are on a Gen 3 Samsung 970 Evo NVMe. Our RAM is 32 gigabytes of 3200 C16. We've got Resizable Bar on, and we're using MSI Z690 Z690 Pro A Wi Fi motherboard. Uh, one note to take is that uh, turning Resizable Bar off, overclocking the 3060, or putting all files on the Gen 4 Fire CUDA made no significant change in rendering times. Here are our results for rendering 12 YouTube 4K videos with the 12700K. The total time of the videos is 179 minutes and 18 seconds, and it took a whopping 67 minutes and 52 seconds to render those videos. And I did a bit of a calculation, and I got a figure of 38%. So basically, if you've got 100 minutes of video to render, it's going to take you 38 minutes, give or take a few minutes. So, that is a great result. Well, if you'd like to see more technology videos about the 12700K, uh, about um, the AIOs, uh, about what the chemistry, our new series of videos that we've started, well, just subscribe and you'll get notified when those videos are ready. Thanks for joining us here on PC Gaming Tech Summary, and don't forget, you'll be seeing me in the next video.